How is God's will done in heaven? In the Lord's Prayer, Jesus instructs us to pray, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. So the question we need to ask is, how is God's will accomplished in heaven? How do the angels perform his will? I think King David gives us a hint in Psalm 103 when he says in verse 20, Bless the Lord, O you his angels, you mighty ones who do his word, obeying the voice of his word. Bless the Lord, all his hosts, his ministers who do his will. Here in Psalm 103, the the angels are called ministers who do his will. And the word uh, for ministers comes from the word meaning to serve. The angels serve their king and do his bidding with perfect obedience. So when we pray, may your will be done on earth as it is in heaven, we're praying that his perfect will would be accomplished on earth by loyal and loving submissive servants, just like the angels in heaven. Now, if you read the the first two petitions in the Lord's Prayer, Uh, They actually work together quite nicely. You have your kingdom come and your will be done. If your kingdom come refers to uh, God's rule, his, his authority in the hearts of people, so we talked about in our last video, then your will be done shows us how that submission to the king is lived out through a life of obedience. I think it's interesting that we find those same two elements in Psalm 103. Right before David speaks about the obedient service of the angels, he says this in verse 19, The Lord has established his throne in the heavens, and his kingdom rules over all. So a proper understanding of God as king leads to submission in our heart and obedience in our actions. As we look around at our world today, we see brokenness and rebellion everywhere. We long for God's will to be done on earth as it is in heaven, for men and women everywhere to obey him perfectly like the angels. And yet if we look at our own heart today, we see brokenness and rebellion there too. Every day we're tempted to serve our desires and make our own plans instead of obeying God's will. So let's pray that God's will would be done on earth and in our own hearts as it is in heaven. And let us eagerly pray that that Jesus would return again soon so that heaven would come to earth and God's will would be accomplished perfectly forever.